what up how's it going so we got kim and she liked that feeling and she want to get more of it you know what i mean also uh we got nacho dealing with lalo and he came in on some smooth shit he came in on some fly shit and tried to act like yo i'm not gonna be in on everything right i'm a little Leave you to your own devices. And then immediately went up there and sat right there during the money count, right? Like not in the back overlooking, right there, eating a sandwich. Well, eating a taco, it looked like, you know what I mean? So, hey, let's go ahead and start this episode and see where this goes, right? We got two more episodes in this season, so let's go. <laughs> Yo, in my mind, my mind was about to ask what happened to her. And then I was like, ain't nothing happened to her. We got the scams going on, don't we? Excuse me. Lubbock though? Uh, my Ish. firm submitted I was just plans about to ask. for Mesa Verde Bank. We're building okay, a branch here in Lubbock. I'm, 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 sure, I'm, I'm, I think I saw off. that come through. As I was cleaning up, refiling all our plans, internally I realized I was missing one of the old versions. We had some late changes to the conference room dimensions, so there were different versions floating around, and things got really complicated. She's going to use the scam to get the job done for Mesa Verde. So long story short, I think it's possible the wrong version ended up in our proposal. And room dimensions should be 15 foot six by 12 foot six. Uh, 15 foot six by 12 foot six. I started trail running a couple months ago, went for a run last week, wasn't paying attention and got my foot snagged in one of the roots, just twisted my ankle. Oof. It hasn't been that bad, except I have an eight month old, so. Oh, congratulations. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Been, there you know, kind of doing it on my own. There we go, get her. My brother's been helping since I'm a little limited these days, driving me around and whatnot. They look the same to me. Great. <laughs> <laughs> yes. No refiling. Ah, thank you. Uh, thank you, Shirley. God. You're welcome. You saved my life. What's the game, though? My boss is. The end game. Would have murdered me. Where's Aiden? He's fine. He's in the Wrangler. Just take a smell because what? it's a little funky. You left my right. child in your Jeep? Yeah, I cracked the window. Uh, I didn't know. <sighs> Sorry. What am I supposed to do? What are you doing? <laughs> you baby. I thought he was going to spill it, like just straight up We're drop it. Clock. But that's even doper. And now you got to take this one that clearly has differences in it. But How's Aiden? we oh, just established that there are no differences. It's the same. Minute, thank God. <laughs> Wait, what, what happened? <laughs> Your milk. You're going to give me your copy. See? <laughs> and I'll trade them out. I like it. Shirley, I can't tell you how much this means to me. Ah, uh, really. she had two in there. Okay. We need to stick together. Fire. Let's make this official. Stamp it. <laughs> no, 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 no. ¿Quién tiene los huevos más grandes de todo Michoacán, norte, sureste y oeste? Era profesor antes de abrir ese lugar, ¿se acuerdan? Siempre lo decía, el gran profesor de la universidad. Se tomó su tiempo con él. Y su esposa escuchaba en la habitación de al lado. Ese pendejo estaba tan orgulloso de su hermoso español y sus libros y sus antigüedades. Pero igual cuando todo se perdió en llamas, olía mierda. Me metí entre las llamas y el humo. Hacía tanto calor que la suela de mis zapatos empezó a quemar. Sí, ya sé que fue muy estúpido, pero... Soy un sentimental. Quería un recuerdo. Oh, it's the bell. <laughs> I was wondering how does he get the bell. Una probada, ándale. <clears throat> Vamos, tío. Tío, hablemos del chileno. The Chilean. <laughs> you gonna get out of there some Werther's original same old Hector just wants to kill everybody what time is your hearing 11 
This time next week, I will once again be James McGill, Esquire. Hmm. Unexpected bonus of the drop phone business. It turns out it's great for client development. Yes, I, I guess that's true. Sooner or later, every last one of those idiots is going to need an attorney. Of course, they all know me as Saul Goodman. What's those details? Gotta say, a lot of people are going to be begging for the old Yule Babino treatment. What's that? Our powers combined. I think we should only use our powers for good. What are we considering good as of 9 or 6 p.m. tonight? You know what? It's like Potter Stewart said. We'll know it when we see it. We just drove 300 miles to scam Lubbock, Texas, so that your client can have a 13% bigger bank branch. Don't get me wrong, I loved every second of it, but how was that using our powers for good? Uh-oh. Die Lampe. Kein yeah. Saft auf drei. Drei ist orange. What's up? My apologies. We have a small problem. How small? The red light. It means there's no, uh, how do you say, continuity on oh. the circuit of one of the three charges. He had it found it, so it was disconnected right by the the actual explosives. Versuch's normal. I think we're ready here, Michael. Four. Three. Two. One, now! That man stressed out like a mo. Oh wait, we're missing one! You don't seem pleased. I'm just tired. I need to know what's going on. Nothing is going on. This work is taking longer than I estimated. It is. And I appreciate the R&R. &R. The boys, <laughs> they had fun. 22 years. Perhaps you will understand. 26 in April. Congratulations. Mm -hmm. My wife, I'm, uh, without her, I am at- Adrift. Uh, yeah, adrift without her. Kai could supervise the work until <laughs> I get back. <laughs> Oh, no. I don't wish to cause you hardship. Kai, even Come on. though no. I'd only be gone for four days, five, maybe total. You want to see your wife? More than anything. Then finish the job. When it's done, from the money you've made here, you'll, you'll never, never have to be leave away her again. from yeah. your wife again. Thank you, my friend. Ugh. I feel like he going he gonna mess Getting up. In there. I know the answer is probably no. But is it possible for me to meet the owner? I am the owner. Really? How lucky Cut it out. for me. <laughs> Excellent. Don't waste that. This way. <laughs> now, what may I do for you, senor? Let me look. Salamanca. <laughs> Eduardo Salamanca, but you can call me Lalo. ¿Alguna vez te has puesto a pensar que ese Don Eladio es un cabrón? ¿Que tal vez le gusta esta mala leche entre nosotros? Se la pasa sentado en su alberca, asoleándose. Nice try. Mientras tus camiones son los que mueven el producto, y los Salamanca son los que lo protegen. No lo considero que haya mala leche. Really? Still. If we were to get along too well, I'm sure Eladio wouldn't like that, would he? I am satisfied with the current arrangement. I'm just shitting you. 
You would be crazy to go up against Eladio. So you pick up six keys a week? Yeah. Where? He's got a chicken farm way out of town. Show me. And for most of last year, you've been employed at CC Mobile? It's a cell phone store. And again, there's a letter from my manager, Mr. Robert Finn. Big that Rob. That's also in the supplemental materials. Bob. I would say it's given me a new outlook on client relations. I mean, after dealing with cell phone contracts, explaining statutes to my clients should be a cakewalk. You know what caught my eye recently was Crawford v. <laughs> Washington. Let's go. And if you follow that, it has to do with the admissibility of ex parte examinations. That was a Supreme Court case, wasn't That's it? That's right. This past year has pretty much been the only thing on my mind. And I'm humbled by the sheer stupidity of my actions. As I sit here, I can assure you, nothing like that will ever happen again. <laughs> never. <laughs> never. Oh, never again. Right. Our legal system is complicated, and sometimes it could feel capricious, but it's the closest thing to real justice that we've got. And for it to work, it needs vigorous, passionate advocates. And helping my clients, you know, arguing on their behalf, that's the best thing I've ever done. And this past year, I've missed the hell out of it. Was there any particular influence on your views? Um, credit where credit is due. Oh, no. The University of America. <laughs> there we <Samoa>. go. <laughs> go land crash. <laughs> Shout out to the writers. <laughs> Anything else? No. They knew what we were all thinking. Like, is he going to, is this going to be some breakthrough? <laughs> You'll be getting a letter with our decision in the next few days. Oh, no, don't do something hey, crazy. Oh, you're denying me? What did I do Mr. wrong? What did I, I do wrong? Mr. Mr. McGill, this okay, is not okay, the place. I did everything right. Please tell me. It was a question of sincerity. Well, well, what? Some members of the committee found you somewhat insincere. They <laughs> so your horse. You're free to apply again next year. They <laughs> so your horse. Which is crazy because on that last question, there was there was some part of it that was like you know we have no problem with that language in the job no 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 <laughs> she's a she's a dope girl for it but Hey there. Changing within the seller's knowledge to to the best of the seller's knowledge. That's Slow down. Fine, but you have to give us a chance. Slow down. All fine, and then one of them out of nowhere comes up with this weird ass yeah, question. Yeah, yeah. Fuck her. Fuck glasses. What does the law mean to you? Mama hate her glasses. That's a big one. It's huge, and I nailed it. I talked about the meaning of the law, and I was down to earth, and I was humble, and I was sincere, and they loved it. I don't. What did they say when you talked about Chuck? See. What does Chuck have to do with this? See, what? that was the thing that well, clued see, You didn't man. even... Why would I? There's just we'll appeal this to them, but we won't let them. And we'll find a way rubber. to make you look sincere. Tim, I was sincere. I know that. I meant we will so fix I might it. have been a little corny, but I meant every They word. said sincerity, but they wanted to show him some sort of... Wanted you to see him. believe me. Of course I do. Oh, Jesus. Be it's like right almost apologetic face. about. You think you know, I'm some kind of low life, thing, some kind of asshole? What? Kind of lawyer guilty people hire, right? Oh, Jimmy, that's. You, you not... look at me and you see slipping Jimmy. I never said that. Yeah, but you thought it. You want to know why the committee called you insincere? Because you didn't mention Chuck. <laughs> what does right. that have to even... They read the transcripts. They know what happened, Jimmy. They were waiting for you to say something about it. So I'm supposed to make a big hairy deal about my dead brother at my reinstatement hearing? How is that sincere? It's crazy because they don't realize how sincere that was. Him responding in that way. At this moment, that's how he feels about Chuck. And that's how he deals with the memory of Chuck. Right? But to them, the fact that he isn't remorseful in any way like they said insincere but to the which is stupid to me that they feel that way like 
his brother died in a horrible way. Fuck you mean he got to mention him to show him sincerity, to show sincerity, right? Like, and so this is one of those things as the viewer, this is interesting. We get it. I understand why he wouldn't mention his brother for multiple reasons at a moment like that. Life goes on, so sue me. There it is again. And that's why we don't have an office. Why, <laughs> do, not, just, you know, do not start in on that office. I don't want to hear another word about that stupid office. Stupid office. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Jimmy, stop trying to change it around. Right, like met. don't do that. Who comes running when you call? She do. And yeah, she throw messes. that thing on you all the time. I have a job, but I drop everything for you. <laughs> a little bored with your life, so you come down and roll around oh. in the street. Have some fun with slipping. Jimmy, oh, don't do this. Fun? Fun Back like up. lying to the ADA to get your friend out of the shitter? Or fun like standing there with a smile plastered on my face while you play infantile mind games on my law partner? Oh, what a mistake it was to take me up to your office in the sky. You'll never do that again. Yeah, maybe I won't. And maybe next time you call, I won't come. There you go. Kick him in when he's down. 